Rita, let's go. It's break time. Uh -uh. I know, Felicia. Let me pack my books. Let me I wonder why it takes you two hours to pack two books only. Uh. Yeah, I yeah. are. Let's go. Wait, where is this girl? She went to see Mr. Mtake. That man. I tell you, that man really irritates me. He's so drunk and broke. I just wonder why he keeps on insisting on Pamela. I really don't know. Does he know the type of men that we, we want ourselves? We want men who drive Porsche cars, a man who can afford a box of pizza, you know, and then he brings his broke whole lot of him as a teacher. Really? I don't know, they have their reasons anyway. Come in. So you wanted to see me? Yes, yes, Pamela. Please, have a seat. No, it's okay. Okay, well, my dear Pamela, you know, I love it when you're close. So are you going to tell me why you called me? Because I have to go for break. Well, my dear Pamela, like I said last time, you know, I can't get myself to stop thinking about you. You are beautiful, okay? And I know it's wrong, but every time I see you... Stop it, Mr. Mtali. I'm tired of hearing this. I've heard it before. You are my teacher, and you're not even close to what I wish for in a boyfriend. But my girl, I... Stop this already. This is irritating. I don't know why I keep on tolerating you. Look, one day, you look deep in that heart of yours, and you will know that you feel the same way that I feel for you. I just pity you, sir. I wouldn't want you to lose your job. Pity me? Yes. Why? Is it evident that you depend on this small pay that you feed your family with? Because I can easily report you for harassment, which can make you lose your job. <sighs> Make this be your last time you call me to your office. Man. <laughs> you know, one to afford pizza and uh, classy things. And pizza and classy things. It's been hard. <laughs> eh? It's not been easy. Seriously. Very hard. Oh, yeah. there she goes. What's up? <laughs> How did it go with Mr. English? Oh, it was horrible. That man doesn't have class at all. You'd have seen his yellow teeth. Ew, gross. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what did he want? He called me to his office, started telling me useless stuff, stuff, blah, blah, blah. I'm the most beautiful girl apparently in grade four. And it's forbidden, <laughs> but every time I see you, my heart skips. <laughs> like you're the most beautiful girl in school. I was like, oh, please, spare me the crap. <laughs> Look, I think the man is in love. Oh, no, please, right? spare me the shame. In love? Which in love? I told him not to mess with me again. Anyway, you did well. Actually, he was coming, you know, he was crossing his limits. He, uh, you know? I even told him, next time he calls me in this office, I'm going to tell the head of me. Mm -hmm. And when he heard that, he was shivered like a little baby. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, tell me about the gossip when I wasn't around. What well, are you talking about? about sure. <laughs> My guy, what's up? Home alone? Ah, boy, home alone. Eh? I don't feel like uh, going for break. Yeah, boy, mm. I wish I could. Just that today I'm broke, boy. I could have a coin. Oh. Yeah, I could have gotten you one anyway. You know, you know how, how, how I just get to buy for, for everyone in this class. So? Hey, what? <laughs> yeah. So how did it go with your baby Felicia? Felicia boy, she doesn't say no to my proposals, but then she seems not to be interested in me. <laughs> Naishiba, mm. that girl she's not the type to love. 
Ali demo if you are ma, and you more like yourself with no cash, mm. you cannot stand the chance. Mm. Boy, if things were like that, mm. then people would have never been in love. Oh no, Man. people would have been in love. The idea accepted that people nowadays fall in love with your pockets and not your luck. Boy, find a girl of your class and be happy. Mm. Ukanjeva. Uh, Kadisha is the one for me. Oh, I can believe it. It's just that. Uh, she hangs out with this Rita girl whose father is doing so good and uh, loaded with some cash. Otherwise, her family is as poor as mine. <laughs> it's just a matter of time. Things will be all right. I know it. Yeah. But, <laughs> but can we not see this in the family then? Yes. Why that is she really juicy? She's poor, mm. but she loves Mula. I like the Magadan that I'm a girl over boy. Why are you being so negative? We can not that in Shaco if you look at the palace. Uh, get out of my presence. <laughs> Just go. I shall wait. I wish I were a soap. Ah, we can be. I wish you Just go. Just go. Just go. What happened? I'm back, my child. Business was very slow today. And as you can see, the vegetables are no longer green. But anyway, I'll make some orders tomorrow morning. Oh, Mom, but, but I told you that I need a pair of shoes and you said that you buy me after selling today. Yes, I did, my son. But just as I explained, business didn't go as I expected. Huh? And now, can you stop whining about the shoes? Go and bring me a cup of water. Oh, Mom, Felicia has new, new shoes almost every day, and yet I have nothing. It's not fair. Felicia, new shoes from where? I haven't given her money to buy any shoes. Well, go and check her bedroom and see what they mean. Enough. Go and get me a cup of water. And Desha. Oh, Mom. Ah, Iwe. Felicia, new shoes from where now? Asking Felicia if she had any luck finding a sugar daddy. <laughs> so? I'm telling you, it's not easy. It's like I'm not even fresh anymore. No and sensible, not even at church. Not even any nice man from church eyed me. Did you even say church? When did you start going to church? You're such a joke. I had to try my luck. Who are you? <laughs> it's not funny. What's funny? It's not funny, I'm telling you, at the rate at which we are going. Who knows? I might even end up with that. <laughs> poor Daniel's guy. But what's wrong? What's wrong with him? He's handsome. Besides, he likes you. <laughs> He's handsome. For me, I'm not about the looks. It's about the man who's going to give me a pocket. You think that Daniel is going to buy me new clothes, new shoes, and take me to different places where I want to go to? That poor soul, all that he has is an intelligent brain. That's all. There's, no, there's nothing he's going to give me. There's nothing there's no he's going to take me.
anyway, we need a plan, guys. But what kind of a plan? Because you know school is almost closing. And if we're not careful, we might end up broke. If not worse, dating these breastfeeding boys in school. That's exactly my fear, Pamela. Huh? Hey guys, I might not need money as much as you. But these school boys, it's a big no. So you know what we do? Let's go home. Let's go and think. Tomorrow we come back and meet and think of and, and give ideas on how we're going to hook those sugar daddies. I don't think they're going to come following us saying, oh no, Pamela, stop. Oh no, Felicia, stop. No. So let's go, let's think and come back. The best deal, the best idea is taken. Deal? Deal. deal. Yeah. Yeah. My God. Where is this girl getting these things from? Am I losing my little one? Oh God, I need you right now. Yeah. Melissa. Okay, okay, okay. Time up, guys. It's time for class. Let's go. Oh yeah, let's go to class before that madame comes. Mm -hmm. You know that bitch after all she's made it in life? I hate her. I don't know if everything I have. And Pamela is there seated busy waiting for her, so I don't know. No, no. I think I have no choice anyway. I just came to say hi. How are you? I'm okay. Mm. You're back early. My friend, the vegetables were telling me about and business is very slow today. You don't say. So I couldn't stay long at the market. I just decided to come. Okay, I see. Anyway, I just came to find out, are we having the meeting tomorrow? Oh yeah, you just reminded me. Actually, the chair called to confirm about the same meeting. Uh, he said we're going to have it here just like we planned. So, Marke Felicia, if I didn't come in your house, if I didn't follow you, you wouldn't have bothered to come I'm and tell me that we're having the meeting you. tomorrow. I'm sorry, yeah. I just had a lot of things on my mind. What's wrong? Mm. I've even been wanting to ask you. From the time I entered, your face looks gloomy. Are you okay? Is everything fine? about my daughter. When you say daughter, you mean Felicia? Yes, my dear. She has these new things in her room. I don't even know where she's, she's getting them from. Mm. But, uh, Felicia, have you spoken to Felicia herself? And you haven't even thought about it. You know Felicia has got friends in school. What if they're the ones that gave her those presents and you're reaching into conclusion? You're thinking maybe she's getting gifts from elsewhere. No, my dear. You know, our girls are turning, you know, they are getting wild nowadays. You know, ever since her father died, it's like um, I cannot provide whatever they needed and she's just opted to go and look somewhere else, I'm sure, from men. 
There is no need of worrying. Felicia is a very intelligent girl and you're aware that she's about to finish her grade 12. And aside from that, she's very much aware of how much hard work you put in for her, her brother and herself. And I'm sure she wouldn't want to disappoint you. You don't need to worry. Just sit her down. Just sit her down, you and her. You sit down, you talk. Then she'll explain things to you other than you acting like this. I and hope you are right, my friend. No, everything will be okay, Vane. Don't worry. Oh, I pray so. Anyway, let me get going. I just came to find out if we're having the meeting today. I, I will see you tomorrow. We'll talk later tomorrow. Anyway, thank you very much for coming, my dear. Okay, I appreciate that. All right, my Please dear. take care. Don't, don't be looking like that. Uh, I bet see the smile on your face. No, you yeah, thank you. At least you've, uh, you've made me happy. I, I, you know what our friend's for. Let's just keep on praying. Huh? Thank you. Everything will be fine. Please remember me in your prayers. Huh? All right. I will. You should also remember me in your prayers. No problem. Okay, Thank you dear. for passing through. All right. Take care. Okay. Bye, mom. Yes. So, like I said, Felicia, just want you and I to be cross special friends like we used to to be <laughs> back then in, in primary. Back those days? Yes. At this age? Yes. We were kids then, but now we've grown up and I don't think uh, we, we can't. Like, yeah. we can't carry on the child fiddle. No, Felicia. This is the right time. Right time for what? For you and I. To? Be cross friends. <laughs> anyway, we'll, we'll see about that. Is that a yes? No, not yet. Hello, Felicia. How was school? Oh, school is okay. Same old routines and everything. Hi, Peter. Was that done ahead outside? I was only saying hi. You're not supposed to be interrogating you. Which anyway? Simple question, and there's supposed to be yes or no. Well, since you know Danny, then you know you can tell it's him. Too secretive, but no, he's your... He's my wife. Agree. Can you shut up? And don't check in and do your stuff. Ah. What? Thank you very much, man. You know this boy, he talks too much. He's over, he's ever here. Anyway, can you go and change as well? You come and join me here. You don't know now. My daughter, I've seen your nakedness almost all your life. God knows what happened to privacy. I'm a grown girl now. What is it? What is there to fear? Eh? Now, talking of privacy, is this the reason why you have new shoes and uh, clothes that I don't know where they're coming from? Which? What? What? You're going through my stuff. Can you answer the question, Felicia? Where are these things coming from? The problem is you think I'm still a baby. I can I can manage and, and, and do things on my own. Anyway, have you started having boyfriends? No, 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 eh? no, no, eh? no, 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 no. Are no. you trying to get what I cannot afford from men? No, no, eh? no. Felicia? No, mommy, no. But how do you explain these things on the bed? Eh? I'm sorry I didn't tell you. Tell me what? Rita's dad. Rita's dad went to went to South Africa recently, so when he came back, she gave me some of the clothes that he, he bought. Don't you dare lie to me. Nice. I'm saying, don't you dare lie to me. Eh? How do you explain uh, Rita's uh, shoe size with yours? 
Do you put on the same shoe she, size? She couldn't fit, so she said maybe I can give them to some of my cousins who don't have shoes. And then I said I'll take them, so I just haven't done it. I'm sorry. I hope you are saying the truth. Yes, Mom. You know, her. I'm working extra hard for you and your brother so that you can make something out of your life. Eh? I hope you're not trying to waste your life, Felicia. Eh? I hope so. Mom, I'm sorry. Eh? Okay, let me finish dressing up. Finish up dressing you. Find me in the kitchen. Yes, Mom. Huh. She's been touching my things, touching my things for what? Does she want? Ah, so. Hi, Faye. What's up? Oh, Vela. Mom almost caught me with those clothes. Okay. So, what did you tell her? Yeah, but anyway, I have covered it up. I've told her to say your sister from, from SA gave you those clothes to give them to me. So when she buzzes, you know what to tell her. Yeah. Don't worry. I know what to say. I was just trying to study, but... You know these things are tough. I don't know how you find these sciences so easy, Faye. Okay, I'm going to help you. I'll, I'll find you. I'll come to you. You always say that. You know my father is going to kill me this time if I fail. Okay, let me try to go through again. Alright. Bye. Bye. Thanks. Ha! Hi, what you want? Uh, no, the truth. What truth? That these things are not from your friend Rita. What do you mean they're not from my friend Rita? What do you know? But I'm saying the truth now. Okay, you know you're such an irritating fool. You know that. All right. Then if you if you insist, you are you're, you're refusing. Now go and tell mother. My friend, go and tell your mother whatever it is that you want to tell her. Oh, uh -huh. All right, I'll go. Go. Chagri, come back here. Again, you're calling me. What is it this time? Okay, what do you want? A 20 can do. No, a 20 can do. Are you mad? Where do you think I'm going to get a 20 kwacha from this time? Where are the clothes and... Ah, shut, shut up. Yambap. Bye. Go! My God and my Father, Lord, I want to thank you for this day that you've given me, Almighty God. Lord, I just want to thank you for our lives, Father, Almighty God. I just want to thank you for the children that you've blessed me with, Almighty Lord, God. Lord, I pray, Father, that you may help me, God, raise these children, Almighty God, according to your will, Almighty I know God. On my own, Almighty God, I have no strength, Jehovah God. Lord, you know, I know Almighty on my God. own, Almighty God, I cannot manage. I do not have the Let strength of my dear God. In you, Father, in Jesus' name. Lord, I just want to pray to you that I know I love you, Lord, 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 that you are Lord, Father, that you are Lord, you are Lord, I give you all the glory. I know you are going to provide for this children. I believe and I pray for you, Father, that you are going to help this children. It is in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, I thanks you, Lord.
He is very determined. He wants to succeed in life. Dad, can I just have my breakfast in peace? Shh. You know how much I love you. You know how much I, I feel for you. You follow her and lag behind. Well, she's always on top. What is this world coming Where? to? This man is calling himself a traditional doctor. Tell her to stay away from me. You're a perfect Bertha. I'm sure you can handle Fedish. Rita, where have you been? Huh? 